Hey guys, I uh, hope you're all well and uh, in the past few months I have been receiving a lot of requests to make a video on uh, Google Maps, Geolocation and Geocoding. So in this video I decided to do Geolocation and Geocoding in your uh, Ionic 2 applications. So uh, for this we are going to make use of two Ionic native plug plugins namely Cordo Geolocation plugin and the native Geocoder plugin. And uh, the Ionic native version, as you know, the latest version has been released and that's what we are going to make use of, the 3.1.0, uh, I think, uh, that's the version that we are going to make use of in this uh, uh, video. So let's get started, guys. Uh, and yeah, it's the 3.1.0. Anyway, uh, first thing we'll do is go ahead and install the uh, pr both the plugins, the one, the geolocation plugin sorry ionic plugin and and the other one as well native geo Plugin add okay this is 10 so uh, the next thing we need to do is sin, uh, from this latest version the latest version they have split every native plugin guys uh, you need to add a wrapper to use that particular plugin alone in your application so that the application size will be drastically reduced so let's install the wrappers for these two plugins now uh, npm install uh, native geocoder and uh, geolocation okay let this get installed uh, meanwhile we'll i have opened up my code here right inside uh, pages home page we'll just have a button we'll just have one button uh, clicking on that button should give us our exact location uh, yeah that's it so that's the point of geolocation geolocation and geocoding uh, you might wonder what that is for those of you who are completely new to this uh, thing geolocation is nothing but getting the latitude and longitude of the location where your device is located at that point of time guys whereas geocoding is nothing but uh, it's it's kind of like there are two things in geocoding uh, forward geocoding which means that uh, we give a the name of a place for example uh, sydney and it would show the latitude and longitude of that place or reverse geocoding uh, which means that we just give the name uh, we just give pass in the latitude and longitude and it will give us back the uh, name of that uh, place corresponding to that latitude and longitude okay so this is geocoding and uh, getting the latitude and longitude of that uh, current location is geolocation okay so uh, we'll have a button upon clicking that button it will get the latitude and longitude of that uh, device uh, of the location in which the device is present and then send both to the geocoder so we'll do a reverse geocoding and uh, we'll try to get the name of the place where that device is located so we'll have a button here button ion button uh, click uh, geolocate okay get location okay very simple piece of code we are just creating a button that's it we'll get into home.ts first we need to import everything right import uh, geo location from at ionic uh, native sorry native slash geo location and uh, import native geocoder from at ionic native slash native geocoder okay very simple piece of code now what we'll do is we'll copy both of these paste it in uh, app.module.ts and register them both as providers okay and uh, here I'll give geolocation and uh, native geocoder 
okay so now inside this i'll give public uh, geo location this is actually a reference for that and uh, another thing public uh, native uh, geo coder geo coder this will be the native geo coder okay why is it showing like this Hey, sorry sorry guys so npm install uh, at ionic native slash uh, native geo coder uh, save the uh, same way we should give for geo location as well but once this is installed i'll uh, do the same for that yeah now same but here it will be geo location okay very 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 simple piece of code now what i'll do is this error will vanish now hopefully Uh, now what I'll do is geo locate was the name of that function, right? So geo locate uh, this dot geo location dot uh, get current position. Before that, let's pass some options to it. Options equal to enable high high accuracy. This I'll set to true. Okay. Uh, and we'll pass the options options dot then uh, it will return a position this position will be of type geo position right we'll import that as well geo position geo position okay and uh, uh, from here i'll call the, uh, uh, the position will have the latitude and longitude so i can pass this to the geocoder so uh, this start uh, get country and i'll pass in the position very simple piece of code sorry position very simple piece of code right uh, catch error get country uh, position so here i'll make use of the geocoder native geocoder to do a reverse geocoding okay so uh, this dot net not uh, geocoder dot reverse geocode uh, we need to pass in the pos dot coords dot latitude and pos dot coords dot longitude okay so this will give return the name of that uh, city and country and the code of the country something like that so dot then uh, this response will have response will be of type uh, it. I'm sweating a lot guys, uh, come on, it's India. Native Geo Code Reverse Result, okay. And uh, uh, let's uh, let's kick it up a notch and show it in uh, Toast Controller maybe. Toast Controller, uh, as a toast maybe, sorry. And Public Toaster, Toast Controller. Uh, let uh, country equal to uh, 
this dot toaster dot create uh, message uh, rest dot country name and uh, duration let's have four seconds okay uh, country dot present okay it's a very very simple piece of code guys what you are doing is uh, once the user clicks the button we are just getting the latitude and longitude using the geolocation plugin first and then passing it on to the geocoder plugin in the geocode in the geocoder plugin we are simply doing a uh, reverse geocoding and uh, passing the latitude and longitude to that and then getting back the name of the country that's all we are doing let's see if this app works so far and uh, yeah let's test it out so just give me a minute guys i'll connect my mobile here so yeah guys uh, the app is now up and running on our mobile device so let's go ahead and click on get location see it's showing up in a toast as india for uh, uh, toast is appearing appearing for four seconds right so this literally means that our code so far works fine i'm uh, uh, geolocation uh, plugin gets the latitude and longitude coordinates of this device location and then passes it on to the uh, native geocoder the native geocoder performs a reverse geocoding and uh, what it does is it returns back the name of the country so uh, which in turn gets displayed on the toast message so uh, so far it works uh, so far so good guys so now if in case i turn off my location settings okay okay i have turned off my location setting now if i click on get location nothing happens right not even an error message gets displayed right so we need to change this scenario we need to tell the user to turn on the lo location settings if it is turned off right so uh, to to do that we will make use of another plugin called location accuracy okay it's also an ionic native plugin so let's make use of that uh, so i'll do ionic plugin add uh, Okay, I pasted this and then let's add the native wrapper for the, this as well. So npm install at ionic native uh, uh, slash slash location. Accuracy. Save. Okay. Let this get installed. Meanwhile, we'll go here and add uh, that here. We'll just copy paste from there. From here, we can copy paste. Right? and uh, let's check first whether we can make a request like they have said here this dot location accuracy dot uh, can request this will be a boolean i guess uh, response this will be a boolean and then Okay. Uh, uh, if response, sorry. If response, then uh, we start from.
and inside this we will give this entire this dot geolocation thing okay uh, now you might have understood right if the location settings is not on then uh, i am requesting the user to turn on the location settings and once he turns it on i am just uh, using the geolocation plugin to get the latitude and longitude and then passing it on to the entire process okay so uh, let me just start kit country or position okay uh, if it is an error if the, not this not this Okay, now let's see if this goes fine. Okay, uh, oh, sorry guys. App is now running and uh, location is turned off. If you can see, I have turned off the location, right? So, let's go ahead and click on get location now. Let's see what happens. See, you can... Uh, see alert like thing right a confirmation prompt right to continue let your device turn on location using google's location service i click on ok and then i receive the toast india right it appears for four seconds so what it has done is it has turned on the location settings for me and then uh, use geolocation plugin to get the latitude and longitude and pass it on to native geocoder which in turn has performed the reverse geocoding using those coordinates and then return the name of the country uh, in which this device is located which is getting displayed in a toast so uh, this is how you make use of geolocation and geocoding plugin in your ionic 2 applications guys and that location accuracy plugin was just for a, uh, how do i say mm, uh, for an enhanced user experience that's what i would say so yeah guys uh, this is what i wanted to show you guys today uh, i think this video might be a bit long but anyway guys uh, uh, I, I i hope this video was helpful to you guys if you found this helpful kindly hit the thumbs up button and kindly subscribe to this channel to watch more cool stuff like this so yeah guys talk to you guys in my next video bye